Hey YouTube, Draco87SJB here. I'm going to do a little review on mine and JMB823's loaders. Alright, we'll start here with the Halo V35. This was my first loader, and I wish I'd never, ever wasted the money on it. I had so many issues with this thing. I mean, the batteries that would short out on me, it would stop loading, the board was fried, uh, it wouldn't, wouldn't stop feeding, and it's literally, in my opinion, a piece of trash. I would never, ever recommend this to anybody. Alright, moving on. This is my second loader. This is the Invert Halo 2. Big improvement on the V35. It's sound activated and has adjustable sensitivities depending on how quiet your gun is. And it also can change feeding speed. It can go up to, I believe, maybe 30 balls per second, which is more than you'll ever need. It's pretty soft on paint. It holds about 200 balls, like basically every loader on the market, besides like the Prophecy or Pinocchio, which hold a little more. Um, it's kind of a pain in the butt to take apart and clean, because just like anybody that's owned a Halo before, it has all those screws that you have to take take out before you can even get inside of it. Um, one good thing is that you can get a various different types of speed feeds, like I have the Exalt on this one here, and this is JMB's, he has a Virtue Crown, kind of modified it a little bit because he lost the uh, adjustable piece right here, so he had to epoxy it on and use the rised, uh, raised, you know, cap thing. Um, of course, everybody knows what this is. This is the die rotor. Many pro teams use this. It is probably my most favorite rotor of, like, loader of all time. I mean, as you can look over here, it's pretty simple as far as the mechanics of it. It's you can take it apart within like I don't know, if you really tried within probably ten seconds and wipe it out, put it back together, get it operating like real quick. It runs on double A's and it just it lasts forever. Like the batteries I haven't changed them once and I've gone through probably ten cases. Um just like any loader you can get various types of speed feeds. This one has the the spine on it. It's good speed feed, it does its job. It will lose balls, just like any other speed feed, like the Exalt or the Virtue, but it tends to hold its shape pretty well. Oh, plus two to it. It's also got a lifetime warranty, so if you ever have any problems with it, you know they'll they'll help you out. All right, um, that pretty much wraps up the loader review. All right, this is uh, JMB823 and Draco87SJB. Catch you later.